Hey Quickies, I wanted to make introducing push notifications to your clients as easy as possible. So what I've done is I've created a PDF that you can make a copy of in Canva and edit to make it your own. So what you'll do is I click on, uh, click here to make a copy. It will open a new tab and then you will click on use template for new design. Now what you can do is once you're in, you can edit your you know, the colors, the text, the icons, whatever you want. Uh, but I want to show you a few key areas that might be a little bit confusing to update. So uh, before I do that, uh, there are three pages to this quick start guide. So the first page is about enabling notifications. The second page is about the notification center itself and then managing notifications. So as you can see that there are cell phone uh, frames on each page, so that makes it very easy to update. What you'll do to get your own screenshots is make a copy of one of your client's links, install the app, and then you can take screenshots and upload those screenshots into your Canva account. Once you have those, all you need to do is click and drag it into that cell phone. You see how that changes? and it automatically you know, places, so that makes that really, really simple to update. Uh, if you are taking screenshots of the exact same page, you shouldn't need to change placement of like any of these um, pop-out sections. They should just kind of be in place. Now, what you will need to do is if you are going to keep these, move the circle or the square out of the way of this like enlarged image, because this is also a frame. So let me pull an example here. So if I wanted to make a, a kind of a standout of this, I would take that same page and crop it by clicking and dragging this up of what I want in that circle exactly. And then just click and drag it in. So you can see that it updates there. I'm going to leave what I have there. And then you can move that circle back in place there. Um, the only difference is that this here is not a frame. So what you'll do in where it's a, a rectangle, what you'll do instead, ah, come here, there we go, is just make a copy again and just crop it to the part that you were wanting to make bigger. All right, make it whatever size you want. Put, you know, put it, put it there and make the, the square around it. And then you'll be all set there. And the same thing, I did the exact same process for this here. Uh, I sent a, no, or this is the notification that they'll see once they've enabled notifications. Um, so you can take a screenshot of that process. Uh, nothing changes in the process here. Uh, take screenshots, drag and drop, make any changes that you want. Um, and then, you know, that's really it. Uh, make sure that you update your business name or anything else that you want to add. If you don't want to share all of these pages, you know, you can download just the individual pages, download, um, I would do this as a PDF, and then you can just choose, you know, if you just want to show them enabling notifications, you can download that individual page. So that's it. Uh, hopefully this helps and have fun introducing it to your clients.